We're uh, going to install the uh, SU rack, the Happy Trails SU rack on the Gen 3 KLR today. And uh, our bolts uh, in the upper positions here are uh, 8 millimeter by 75 socket uh, head cap screws. And in the front, uh, where we're going in with the foot peg, it's an 8 by 50. So it's going to be a real simple install. We're not going to uh, relocate turn signals or anything. So we just put our first bolt in, uh, run it up. Okay, so once we've got all the bolts uh, in place, we want everything rattling loose. It's really critical that we go ahead and do things like that. So all the bolts are in, they're rattling loose. You can see that we have plenty of adjustment in here and the adjustment is for frame drift. Uh, these holes can change locations uh, in the different bikes uh, when they weld up and when the frame draws and the same thing can happen with us. So we've got plenty of adjustment uh, in here. We're going to get the uh, other side on and uh, have it uh, at the same place. So on the SU racks, um, where to put them, uh, just line them up in the center of the slotted holes uh, and we'll, we'll start there and then just make sure you just run your bolts up just to where everything is just loose and this is after you have the other side on just run them up to where they're just right up there but you can still move it back and forth and what we'll do is we'll just put it right in the center and then just a little a little snug we'll do the same on the other side and then we're going to put the bumper on so when we're tightening this bumper up I get one side and I get it lined up to where it's flush and uh, snug up one of the the bolts uh, these will walk around a little bit on you so just make sure you get it good and level then I come over to the other side and typically the bumpers are sprung a little bit so you have to push in hold it and get it in there and um, I should have showed you earlier but the slots in these bumper tabs one's going horizontal and the other one's going vertical so you'll have lots of adjustment we don't need that adjustment today because everything's fitting very very well but after you're out and you use them and the bike falls down and things get tweaked that'll let you get everything adjusted later on so just go around tighten up the three bolts on each side make sure your four bolts on the bumper are tight and then we're good to go the uh, gen 3 klr racks are uh, on the website there'll be a link uh, down below that you can uh, use to order them our first batch of uh, uh, racks is uh, in and I think most of them are already sold but we'll have uh, some more in in a few more weeks so uh, give us a try thank you